Hello, I'm Tammy Taylor, president of Tammy Taylor Nails, and I'm so excited to demonstrate for you my HEMA-free gel system, created specifically for sensitive nails and nail allergies. One of my dearest friends has severe nail allergies, and she has always wanted to have gel manicures. But every time she would have gel applied, her cuticles would get red, swollen, and itchy. But now, with my HEMA-free gel system, she has her gel manicures with zero irritation and zero allergic reaction. My HEMA-free gel system has HEMA-free primer, HEMA-free base gel, and HEMA-free top gel. My HEMA-free nail primer and my HEMA-free base gel protects the natural nail and my HEMA-free Top Gel encapsulates the color gel polish to prevent HEMA from touching the natural nail or the skin. So now you can turn every gel polish manicure into a HEMA-free nail service. Now all your sensitive nail clients can enjoy beautiful nails. I will be using Vanilla Sandalwood Conditioning Cuticle Oil, Vanilla Sandalwood Sanitize, 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 Vanilla Sandalwood Polish Remover, My Hema Free Primer Bond, My Hema Free Base Coat Gel, My Hema Free Top Coat Gel, My Fawn Beige Gel Against Gel Polish, Clean It, My Metal Cuticle Pusher, My Long Lasting 180 Zebra, My Primer Holder, My Plastic Manicure Brush, and My Towelettes. Sanitize your hands and your client's hands with Sanitize, Sanitize, Sanitize. Available in Vanilla Sandalwood, Peach, Gardenia, and Fragrance Free. Now I will be removing the polish with Vanilla Sandalwood Polish Remover, also available in Peach and Gardenia. And even if there isn't any polish on the nail, I still clean off the nail to remove any residue. Now I'm going to shape the nail using my long-lasting 180 grit zebra file. One direction in one direction. When you're filing natural nails, you want to be very gentle. Now I will be removing the shine off the nail with my long-lasting 180 grit zebra. This promotes adhesion. Very gently go from one side to the other side, removing all the shine from the nail. Going one direction, from one side to the other, go around the cuticle until there's no shine on the nail. If there's any shine on the nail, then the gel polish could peel. Now I'm going to remove the dust from the nail using my disinfectable plastic manicure brush, going from cuticle to free edge. Now I'm going to push back the cuticle using my metal cuticle pusher, and I like to push back the cuticle after removing the shine, as the dead skin and cuticle will push back easier. You can see all that dead skin coming up off of there. Now I'm going to dust off the nail going from cuticle to free edge. Now I'm going to apply a thin coat of HEMA free primer bond, a non-acid nail primer. This dehydrates the nail, kills the germs on the nail and prepares the nail for adhesion. I'm going to dab my brush and apply sparingly, covering the whole nail. Wipe off my brush before I place it back into my bottle so I do not contaminate my primer. And I always use a primer holder so it doesn't spill. Always remember, chemicals should never touch the skin, especially clients with sensitive nails and nail allergies. Now I will be applying my HEMA-free base gel. Wipe away from me, drag towards me halfway down. Place the brush 1 32nd of an inch away from the cuticle and just gently push towards the cuticle and then nice long strokes stroke all the way out cap the tip 
and one more stroke so you don't get any bulbies on the edge of the free edge. The Hema Free Base Gel is a protective base that prevents color gel polish from touching the nail bed. Cure one minute in an LED or two minutes in a UV. I am using my Mighty Mini 36 watt LED. You can apply one or two coats depending on how much strength is needed. I'm going to apply two coats. Again, wipe away from me. Wipe halfway down towards me. Place the brush 1 32nd of an inch away from the cuticle. Slightly push towards the cuticle. And nice long strokes. Cover the entire nail. Cap the tip. And one more stroke. Maybe two more strokes. For no little bulbies. Looks great. Cure one minute in an LED. Two minutes in a UV. Now I'm going to apply Fawn Beige Gel Against Gel Polish. Wipe away from me. Halfway down towards me. Place 1 32nd of an inch away from the cuticle. Push towards the cuticle and the nice long strokes. Cover the entire nail. Cap the tip and one or two more strokes so we don't get any little bulbies. Cure one minute in a 36 watt LED or two minutes in a 36 watt UV. Now I'm going to apply my second coat of Fawn Beige. Wipe away from me. Wipe towards me halfway down. Place the brush 1 32nd of an inch away from the cuticle and push up towards the cuticle and then Nice long strokes. Cover the entire nail. Cap the tip. And stroke again. So it's nice and smooth. Then we're going to cure again. One minute in a 36 watt LED. Or two minutes in a 36 watt UV. Now I'm going to apply Hema Free Top Coat Gel. Wipe away from me. Drag towards me halfway down. Place the brush 1 32nd of an inch away from the cuticle. Push up towards the cuticle and then nice long strokes. Cover the entire nail. Cap the tip. Again. One or two more strokes so it's nice and smooth. Cure one minute in an LED or two minutes in a UV. My Hema Free Top Gel encapsulates the color gel polish so there isn't any Hema coming in contact with the natural nail or surrounding skin. Now I'm going to clean off the tacky layer with Clean It and a Towelette. Now I'm going to apply Vanilla Sandalwood Conditioning Cuticle Oil, also available in Peach and Gardenia. And rub that in. It feels really good. Moisturizes the cuticles. Clients should use this every day. It also helps their nails grow out really healthy. Now you have your Hema Free Gel Manicure. And remember, at Tammy Taylor Nails, nails are always fun and never feel like work.